We are very pleased to welcome this gentleman. I don't know where to start with you. This is Sophia Menard. Hi, we haven't Sophia nice works you. with us on Fox Sports Wisconsin, and she handles our social media on our television product. You are the king of social media in the NBA. You won an award, the first big award for your social media. How did you come to that, and uh, what do you try to do with that? I take a lot of pride in that award. You know, I haven't won many professional awards yet, so uh, that's kind of sitting alone on a mantle right now. <laughs> Well, we can add to that, hopefully. Uh, let's do it. Let's, let's do, do it. it. <laughs> Kendall Marshall, last year, assist per minute. I think you were second in the league to Chris Paul. That says something. Um, how can you help this young basketball team? Jason Kidd likes to use multiple ball handlers. We saw that last year in Brooklyn, second half of the year when they had success. Uh, you're going to be a big part of that, aren't you? Uh, well, hopefully, you know, if I do what I'm supposed to do. But, uh, you know, I, I want to be a part of the plans here. Uh, I want to be a big part of the rotation, as does every player. But um, I, I'm just trying to come here to contribute, you know, try to get guys, you know, spots to be successful, you know, and let them take easy shots. So uh, that's what I take pride in, hopefully what I can bring to the table. When you were claimed off waivers, waived by the Lakers, claimed by the Bucks, I thought it was one of the most savvy moves I've seen here in a long time. That was a great move for this franchise. How did you feel about that? I was excited. You know, my initial reaction was uh, I get to play with John again, so I was excited about that. But, uh, you know, just the changes they have going here, you know, an opportunity to come in and help out, uh, that's all you can ask for in this league. You know, it's a, it's a very cutthroat league, as, you know, I've noticed the past couple years. So um, uh, any anytime you can walk in somewhere and there's a glimmer of opportunity, you, you have to be excited about it. Do you have a sense, and do the players have a sense of how new it is in Milwaukee right now with the new ownership and all of that? Because, you know, things transpire over time, and teams and cities and everything, players, broadcasters, we all get reputations. But we're starting over right now. Do the players understand that, and how do they feel about that? Uh, I think they do. You know, I talked to a, a lot of the guys that were here last year, and they say you can you can feel the difference. You know, it's a lot, a lot more positive vibe. You know, uh, I think the, the guys on the team, uh, get along great, you know, uh, the coaching staff has been great with us. Uh, and so everybody's pretty excited about the, uh, what, what, what we can do, you know, in the next year and years to come. You bring up being reunited with John Henson. I mean, to break down his game for us, just what it was like to play with him in college, how you've seen him develop as a pro, and how excited you guys are to be uh, reunited here with the Bucks. Oh, I, I'm extremely excited to play with him. You know, uh, not just on the court, but he's one of my best friends off the court. And uh, I think when you have that, it's a lot easier to not just play for yourself, but to play for somebody else. And uh, hopefully we can develop that throughout the entire team. But, uh, you know, he brings a lot to the table. You know, his length is unmatched, except for on this team with, you know, Giannis <laughs> and Larry. But, you know, throughout the league, you know, you're not going to find length like that. And uh, he plays with a high motor, you know, things like that. And defensively, he, he does things that other guys just can't do. So uh, I'm excited to play with him. To have the opportunity to play for Jason Kidd, one of the all-time great point guards. I mean, what can you take away from him as a former player, now a head coach? Uh, well, hopefully I can uh, I can learn from him the things that I take pride in, you know, the things that I take pride in. He's master as far as, you know, running a team, being a leader, uh, uh, getting guys opportunities to score, uh, and being a head coach on the floor. You know, all those things are things that I, I want to master, and he's already done. So if I can learn those things from him, Am I correct that uh, you may have a knack that he had? You both are about the same height, and you can pass over the defense very well. Uh, I think I have the knack on a much smaller level right now. But, <laughs> uh, maybe, you know, maybe one day I can uh, I can get to. He can teach maybe you that though. That, that's the plan. That's yeah. The plan. Uh, right. I'd love to learn. You will be playing with your second out of the Kumbo. You oh, played yeah, with. Yeah. Uh, Giannis's brother, briefly last year, you went down to Delaware in the D-League. Uh, so you've hit both of those two guys. I have, I have. I, um, I played with a... Hi, and bye. Oh, hi. Oh, and bye. <laughs> you don't have to leave. I do. I got to leave. Oh, you do have you to leave. Okay. You, all right. You want to be an interview? You want to be an interview? No, just tell them, like, ownership best ever. <laughs> so, I mean, ownership's the best ever, you know, like you said. <laughs> Mr. Mike Lazarus is talking by. I tried to grab him for an interview, but... Uh, That's the best video Bob will have all day, I think. It is. Probably. I don't know if be better And you did, you did, we'll, we'll make sure that we relay the message. You did your job. Set it on the live best stream. Ever. Best ownership ever. Best ownership. <laughs>
<laughs> oh, but uh, what was that? Unten de, unten de Kupo. Very good, brothers. Out of the Kumbo. Somebody tried to ask me to spell it. Yeah, the that, other that's no. actually our next question. Do it. <laughs> do it. No, his, his brother was great. You know, um, uh, you can tell they have a, a very genuine family. The time I spent with his older brother, um, a great kid. You know, plays extremely hard. Uh, I think he'll he'll find a place in this league. And uh, being able to play with his brother, I'm excited about too. Who's obviously a special talent. So uh, I, I've been blessed to play with that family thus far. Thanasis, of course, drafted in the second round by uh, the New York Knicks. Kendall, thank you so much for stopping by, and uh, we're going to enjoy watching you this year. Thanks, man. Yeah, welcome to Milwaukee. All right, thank you.